Thank you for staying with 13. The time is now 614 AM. This year, the Dudley Funeral Home celebrates a century of serving the Dublin community. Their legacy, though, is much more than just a funeral home. Back in the day, you can find them in the Green Book. Visionary Herbert Hub Dudley provided countless services for black people living in a segregated central Georgia. Today, family members are keeping his business and legacy alive. The building actually existed um, starting back in the early 1900s and is thought to have been built in 1898. The story of Herbert Hub Dudley began with a grocery store where people could buy on credit. Dudley made it his mission to provide services for black people in Lawrence County. So there were dry goods in this, in this building and in the building next door was actually a meat market. So people have been coming here for different things for at least the last 120 years. Carl Pearson is Dudley's grandson. He says his grandfather ultimately provided more than just goods and services. There was also a bank established in order to make sure that people had um, more access to, to cash and things. There was also a barber shop, bank, cafe, mattress factory, casket manufacturing company, and even the Dudley Motel. And with all the traffic coming on US 80 before I-16 was available, uh, this was a very, very busy place. When traveling between Macon and Savannah, the motel served as a safe haven for black people looking for a place to stop in the Green Book. Dudley's dream of providing services and safety for African Americans in a segregated South also led to the fight for equality. And then, of course, along with the civil rights efforts, we had people such as Martin Luther King and his constituents to come through. But they were coming here for planning meetings during the civil rights era. Um, in the 60s. Pearson says folks like Little Richard, James Brown, and gospel groups would also stay at the motel. Because a lot of things would not have occurred or wouldn't have happened today had it not been for Hub Dudley. Former Dublin City Councilwoman and interim mayor Julie Drigger says Dudley helped make Dublin the city it is today. Mm -hmm. And it's a huge history, one that Dublin ought not to ever forget. Most of the original businesses are long gone, but the Dudleys continue to serve families at their funeral home. Yes, I mean, it makes me very proud to know that, that they put forth such an effort and committed their lives to making sure that, you know, every morning it was, you know, make sure the businesses are open, make sure that the phones are answered. And Pearson hopes generations to come will be inspired to serve the community for another century. It was great to work on this story, and it's so great to see that the Dudley family is continuing to make an impact all across Lawrence County. And even today, the Dudley Funeral Home continues to help people in Dublin by pricing funerals at very reasonable and competitive prices. And Pearson tells me that they work out payment plans for whatever type of funeral that people would like. And of course, if you want to read a little bit more about this story, you can find it on our website. That's at 13WMAZ.com.